Hey guys, Puff here. Uh, Dead by Daylight's Bone Chill event has returned. Uh, it's Dead by Daylight's winter holiday event. Uh, in this video, I'm going to be quickly going over everything you need to know about the event, um, all the in-game rewards um, and uh, in-game mechanics, uh, and then I'm going to give my personal thoughts on the event afterwards if, you, if you're interested in that. Um, so first off, the in-game event. Um, when you're in-game, you can go into Snowman, um, similar to previous years, um, but now some of the snowmen are decoys and they're just like a jump scare. Um, and then besides that, uh, there's now piles of snow and you can pick up little snowballs to throw at your teammates uh, and to throw at the killer. Um, if you throw it at a snowman and somebody's in the snowman, it'll, it'll break the snowman on them. Um, but it doesn't blind or do anything like that, so... Um, there's no real incentive to do it other than just to throw a snowball at people and get a very little bit of blood points. And then let's go over the cosmetics you can unlock. So the event is kind of working similar to the Halloween event we just had a couple months ago. Um, you basically, they're going to have uh, tome challenges. Um, looks like we're going to get three weeks of challenges. All the challenges are pretty easy. Like Each challenge shouldn't take you more than a match to, to complete. Um, and then by completing the, the tome challenges, you get um, little frosty trinkets. It's a, a little event currency. And then you spend the event currency on event items. And for each event item you unlock, uh, you get a milestone reward point. Um, and then every couple of milestone reward points you get, you, you unlock an additional item. Um, I'm pretty sure it's going to be the same way it was during the Halloween event, where you need to complete every single challenge in the tome um, to get enough... Uh, event currency to unlock all the items um, so there's a lot of items to unlock uh, if you don't get all of them um, I'm pretty sure all the uh, sweaters and killer skins are going to be available in the shop next year um, they usually do that anything that was uh, event locked previous years is available in the store the, the following year um, so nothing too crazy there now my thoughts on the event um it kind of fucking sucks. <laughs> uh, it's definitely not as fun as the Halloween event. In game, there's just no reason to do anything related to the holiday event. Um, throwing snowballs is like just kind of a meme. Uh, the, you get 150 points for hitting somebody with a snowball. It's like completely negligible. Um, you can't really farm event points. Um, going into the snowman, again, just kind of a meme. No real reason to do it. Um, killers, if you go into the snowman, survivors are just gonna gen rush. Survivors, if you go into the snowman, your killer's just gonna kill your teammates while gens don't get done. So, no real reason to interact with the event, um, stuff, which is a shame. Um, unlike the Halloween event where you're, there was just like an, more of an incentive to do, do things during the Halloween, Halloween event. Um, you got more blood points, and, and the fact there's no offering for for the holiday event is is absurd to me i, I want to be able to farm blood points you know uh, at least with the halloween event they had the the rods you could use to get bonus blood points for interacting with the holiday event there's there's nothing to do in game this this year around uh for the for the holiday event and that's a shame i don't know um i really feel like they could have uh did a little better uh and then the, the throwing the snowballs is just awkward you have to aim aim down to be able to like throw them accurately or also you just like throw them up into the sky um kind of kind of awkward throwing them and then your character doesn't even do like an animation of them throwing it it just kind of like flies out of your face um so yeah i think uh, i think they definitely missed the mark this year with with the event uh, i'm still gonna do all the tome challenges and unlock all the cosmetics um but i'm a little bummed i'm not gonna be able to like farm bonus blood points um and there's not really a, a huge incentive to, to keep playing it beyond uh, just doing the tome challenges and, and then logging out, you know. Oh, well. Um, I'm still going to be playing, still going to be uh, enjoying the event as much as I can. Um, hopefully next year we, we get a little bit more of a, uh, uh, an interactive event. I don't know. That's going to do it for this week. Uh, I'm sorry the video is so short. Uh, there's just not really a whole lot to say about the event. Um, let me know down below, you know, what you guys think of the event. Are you enjoying it? Do you think it's great? Are you happy? Are you sad? Are you mad? Are you glad? Are you bad? I don't know. Just let, let me know your thoughts uh, on the event down below. 
Um, that's going to do it for this week. Hit me with a like if you enjoyed the video. Drop a sub if you loved it. Uh, and I'll catch you guys next week. Buff out.